Well, it's an issue that we've been hearing about for years, our overuse of antibiotics and the creation of drug-resistant bacteria. Well, now man's best friend, believe it or not, is contributing to the problem. Humans can get Campylobacter from pets. We know this for a fact, and some of those uh, infections can be resistant. Tonight, News 5's Tara Molina is taking a closer look at puppies. The recent nationwide outbreak tied to them and the bacteria were having trouble fighting. And also what's being done to prevent it from happening again. We love them. We care for them. Most of us consider them a part of our family. But in some cases, our four-legged friends are making us sick and it's our fault. I learned what's being done to keep the problem at bay locally. It's a problem for pets and their people. Good boy. And unfortunately, sometimes it's connected. And just recently, it's kind of come to a head where we're seeing more and more of it. It's, a, it's a, definitely a concern. Dr. Scott Zielinski told me it's rare, but they do see issues with antibiotic resistance in dogs here at West Park Animal Hospital. We haven't quite gotten to the point where they're so resistant that we don't have options. So it's top of mind. We think about it every day. We try as a community not to promote antibiotic resistance. So every decision we make about infections does uh, involve worrying about resistant bacteria. With the recent nationwide outbreak sickening 118 people, more people in Ohio than anywhere else in the country, 32 total, some had to be hospitalized. Most of those infected had contact with a puppy in a pet store puppies that received antibiotics to prevent infection, not for treatment of an illness. And that does contribute to antibiotic resistance because the more you use antibiotics, the more the bacteria become resistant. According to CDC reports, some of the antibiotics given to the puppies, the same that the people infected were resistant to. The puppies and the people sick from the same thing. In that case, Campylobacter. Campylobacter causes uh, diarrhea is the, the main issue, I think, in pets and people. So what can we do? Some of the things that you do think about from your pet standpoint to avoid infection is hygiene, washing your hands uh, after handling the pets, and also making sure that your pet is well taken care of if it's sick. You can find some more information about this issue, data from the CDC, and information from their investigation when you head to our website and our News 5 app. Reporting in West Park Animal Hospital, I'm Tara Molina, News 5.